Hello, uh, it's Dr. Raffray. I hope you enjoyed all other videos about uh, how to be a good designer. And today we are going to demonstrate a case with uh, complicated apartments. And uh, we need custom apartment. Uh, you, should, you should be know that uh, the custom apartment is not key to every problem in prosthodontics, especially in implant. But it can be helpful in case that we have uh, different paths of insertion, implants uh, put it in uh, not proper position. Okay, and we are going to choose uh, abutment crown, zirconia, five axis, custom abutment, titanium, and a scan body, uh, because we have a scan body. Separately design virtual gingiva. Yes, after this video, we will show you how to design superstructure on abutment that you customized. And before you uh, get the abutment from the laboratory, you can design the crowns so the crowns be printed or milled, and while the uh, other parts are, uh, especially temporary, are getting ready. Okay, I take the control and 31 and 42, and we have Pontic over here, another Pontic, and this one we should change by yes, color A1, okay, and it uh, included the other jaw okay this is the bridge okay i will save it and i'm going to design at the design part we need uh, three scans lower scan lower abutment scan or a scan body and we need uh aperture as uh or other scan okay let's go for one drive yeah you can find the files for this demo uh, I will uh, put the links to download and you can download them okay there's a large uh, okay and we have scan markers and we need aperture okay good I'm going to uh, Run the articulator because in many times we have problem with software and They show us wrong uh, position. I think we have this problem here, so I should go back, put like this. I hope it works. Fingers crossed. So you learn when you have problem with articulator. It, this problem is made in the first stage okay it's far better okay let's see whether it's working and yes it's working <laughs> thanks for it because uh, I have same problem with other cases and after many times I uh, recognize that uh, you should do everything in proper order and in case that you miss one step or say okay i will do it uh later no you can't do it later you should uh not skip uh error in every stage and you should do everything meticulously at proper time okay oh my gosh look here look what i found still not set yes look this is perfect sit 
why uh, I insist on being meticulous in this part because when you design like this the abutment is not uh, sitting properly uh, I think yeah this is the best uh, sitting position and it shows that you have a perfect match uh, I think I did something wrong let's try it again ah uh, yeah this the second one is a narrow implant so I should use the narrow library okay this is better and for the third one it's regular I do the best fit and also I have the same problem see no a little bit better no 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 come on no oh, one tiny bit yes yes that's good that's good uh, you should be uh, in proper position in proper uh, because in case that you uh, give the landmark and other than ideal position you will be in deep trouble okay the first emergence profile the scope emergence profile can be marked with four points but I use six or seven most of the time it's give me the better results and look how this encouraged the bone okay we draw the emergence profile and now we should uh, put the teeth in proper position Okay, it's better. Good, 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 good. A little bit more. Okay, awesome. Sometimes you need to do it individually. 